It's time for a history lesson. Now, as you may or may not know, today is November the 5th. And while that's not important in like 99% of countries, it's my fuck you, I don't care. <laughs> I'm a homosexual. All right, let's try that again. As you may or may not know, today is November the 5th. And while that is not important in almost every country in the world, here we use it as a celebration. And I'm just gonna come out and say it, it's fucking pointless. November the 5th is Guy Fawkes Night, where we celebrate a failed assassination attempt on King James I, all the way back in 1605, where Guy Fawkes and a few of his mates put gunpowder underneath the House of Parliament and they wanted to blow it up. But the night before, police went into the cellar, found Guy Fawkes with 36 barrels of gunpowder, arrested him, I'm guessing. I wanted to kill the king, not all Parliament. Do you not want to kill all of them, though? Oh, Alright, okay. I've just been informed that he wanted to kill the king, not anybody else. Oh, it's to do with Catholics and shit. They were all Catholics and they went mental because King James was being a dick to Catholics or something. I don't know. We don't really do anything important on Guy Fawkes Night. It's just, like, fireworks and big bonfires in gardens. And sparkles as well. If you've never played with sparkles, you're missing out because sparkles are fun, but not really. Well, they are until you're about ten and then they lose the magic, I guess. So basically, on November 5th, we just blow up lots of tiny bombs and make lots of big fires to celebrate an extremist terrorist attack. It doesn't make any sense to me. Although, nowadays, it's pretty much completely irrelevant. It's just an excuse to get very drunk, which is what I'll be doing tonight. So I suggest you all do it the same and do it in memory of Guy Fawkes, who was hung, drawn and quartered for trying to blow up lots of important people. 